good evening. This is Josh. Today, I will make another Jasper JTAG using a Falcon. This Falcon has a dead GPU, and instead of replacing it, I'm going to move the CPU to this Jasper V1 that I have already prepared. So, let's get started. I've used RGH 1.2 to get the CPU key. Now I am going to have to blow the CBLDV from 4 to 5 in order for the Jasper exploitable bootloaders to work. Alright, that's done. You can see we have now an F in the fifth place, so I'm going to go ahead and try to build an exploitable image for the console. Alright, I have cleaned all the flux, applied fresh thermal paste, and bridge the eFuse protection. Let's go ahead and start the system. And our exploitable Jasper is going to boot into Blade's retail NAND and it is ready to be JTAGged. If you are interested in purchasing this system, it will be listed over at rghnation.com soon with a JTAG install done, probably some extras. The system is finished. I hope you enjoyed this video and let me know if you have any questions. Mm -hmm.